Hello and welcome to another video by earringvox.com. Today we will be discussing about Sigma Insio Chargenbo AX. We will be discussing more about its features, its pros and cons, and also we will be discussing the pricing of Sigma Insio Chargenbo AX in India. So let's get started. Sigma Insio Chargenbo. AX is the world's first wireless charging in the ear custom hearing aid. It was introduced in October 2021 and it was made with augmented experience that is the AX platform. Now we will be overviewing what are features are available in Signia Insio Charging Go AX. It has two types of custom shells available. First is half shell, and the second is ITE full shell for in the canal hearing aids. It has six color options, which is black, dark brown, brown, mocha, tan, and beige. We will be looking at the colors in the next slides. It is rechargeable with contactless charging. It comes with compatibility of Apple and Android devices. With audio streaming, it is suitable for mild to moderate hearing loss. It has dual processors, which processes speech and noise separately. It has E2E wireless 4.0. What this feature does is it transfers sound from one hearing aid to another and syncs it, so that it will be a wholesome experience for the hearing aid user. So the Transfer rate. The binaural audio transfer rate has been increased by 110% from the previous devices. The next feature is reduced binaural latency. The data transfer between two paired devices has been reduced by 60%. The rechargeable battery runtime is increased by 22%. It comes with cross and bi-cross compatibility and it has three different levels of technology 7AX, 5AX and 3AX. All these three technologies have varying features and varying cost prices. To understand more about these technology levels, you need to consult your audiologist and they will be explaining you which features are available in which technology level which can help you to get the best out of the hearing aid which you select. So here are the key features of Signia Insure Charging Go AX hearing aid. The first feature is rechargeability. It is powered by contactless magnetic resonance charging system. It has built-in lithium-ion rechargeable batteries. The magnetic resonance charger allows drop and go feature. So what happened in the previous versions is that you needed to align the metal contacts below the hearing aid with the charger. But in uh, this has been eliminated uh, by the by the company, and now you just have to drop both your hearing aids in the charger, and it will be. It will start charging. Now you don't need to worry about lining up those contacts and keeping the metal contacts clean. Now it has shorter recharge cycle times. 24 hours of wait time just requires 4 hours of charge. Streaming, but you need to take care that streaming audio can reduce the wait times. Signia has suggested 20 hours of wait time with 5 hours of streaming. The new charger has been intuitively designed for ease of use. Color coding has been added to the charger where red indicates right and blue indicates left. So you won't be confused where you should put your right earring aid and where you should put your left earring aid. The earring aids will automatically turn off when you place it in the charger and it will turn on when you remove it from the charger. So this design, this feature has been introduced for geriatric population who has dexterity issues. 
if they cannot put it properly so this feature will help them a lot for insure charge and go ax there is no portable chargers available as on date so you have to consider this while buying the product the next feature we'll be talking about is smartphone compatibility it is compatible with apple and android bluetooth bluetooth streaming the android audio streaming is enabled via audio streaming for hearing aid protocol which is also called as asha apple streaming has been enabled via apple's proprietary made for iphone mfi protocol the list of compatible ios and android devices are listed are given in the description below next we will be talking about hands free calling hands free calling is actually not supported with the hearing aids if you want to add this feature into your hearing aid you need to purchase a separate accessory called signia streamline mic it will enable you to have hands free conversations or hands free streaming uh, with your mobile device next feature is augmented focus augmented focus uses two separate processors for processing the sounds the first processor is used to understand what you want to hear for example conversations or uh, sounds which are important to you and the second processor is is used to separate the surrounding noise this will uh, create a contrast between both of those sounds and it will help the user to focus on the sound which they want to hear the next feature is extended dynamic range usually input signals are analog and it is converted into digital signals by the hearing aid but if the analog signal the sounds which are coming inside the hearing aid is too loud then the quality of translation decreases and the clarity will suffer for that extended dynamic range was introduced it will help the hearing aid to process loud louder sounds which will in turn help you to enjoy music or to enjoy different concerts or to enjoy theater or cinema without any issue the highest input limit is 117 db as i said that this is useful if you enjoy music now the loud sounds uh, which come into the hearing aid it won't be muffled it will be more clearer and more natural now you can enjoy your concerts you can enjoy your favorite musicians with more clarity the next feature is acoustic motion sensor what this sensor does is that it will recognize when you whenever you are in motion and automatic directionality will be applied so what happens when you normally start walking with the hearing aid you will only hear what's in front of you but if you are in a group the person you are talking to may be on your left side or your right, right side so what this feature does so what this feature does is recognizes that you are in movement and it will process the signal accordingly so if you are in an active group of people so it, it will allow you to stay engaged in that conversation the next feature is signia assistant signia assistant is available in android and ios using this assistant the ai will make specific adjustments to your hearing aid according to your preferences and your hearing environment so for example if you are watching television the ai will automatically switch to television mode if you are walking in a crowded street the ai will uh, change the settings accordingly what this does is it will help you to adjust with the hearing aids on the go without making any changes to the settings now and then next we will be talking about tinnitus features of the 
Sigma NCO charge and go AX. Sigma devices in all offer multiple signals for tinnitus complaints. This includes ocean wave sounds, white noise therapy, pink noise therapy, and Sigma also provides customizable notch therapy. To understand what these therapies does, does it's best to speak to your audiologist for multiple options. The next feature is smaller size. NCO AX face plates are smaller than its previous generation. Face plates are the chipsets which fit inside the hearing head. In the previous generations, uh, the Bluetooth antenna was placed inside the face plate. But now in NCO AX, the antenna is placed inside the cell and not on the face plate. Hence the hearing aid is smaller. And it also now allows a placement of push button on the hearing aid so that it can be manually controlled. Color options. As I said before, Signia NCO AX is available in six different color options, which is black, dark brown, brown, mocha, tan, and beige. The other feature is cross functionality for single sided deafness. Cross means contralateral routing of signal. When Signia NCO AX is coupled with another cross charge and go AX device, what it will do is it will transfer the noise from the affected device from the affected ear to the better ear so that you won't miss out on any sounds. This will enable the unaidable ear to hear without turning your head. Now we will be talking about compatible accessories with Signia NCO Charge and Go AX. The first accessory is Streamline Mic. It is used for hands-free calling. Second accessory is Streamline TV. It is used for streaming the TV audio in directly into your hearing aids. The third accessory is Mini Pocket. Mini Pocket is a remote and you can put it in your pocket and manually control the hearing aid connected with it. The other two compatible accessories are is the NCO AX charger for recharging the hearing aid and the Signia smartphone app which is available in Android and iOS as we have discussed before. Now we will be talking more about pros and cons of Signia NCO charging go AX and how it offers a huge advantage over its previous versions of products. So the pros are it has Asha Android compatibility, it has contactless charging system which will help people with dexterity issues or vision problems. It has an excellent battery life. The augmented focus improves on sound quality and ease of listening. Extended dynamic input range improves the sound quality for loud sounds. Cross feature is available, tinnitus therapy is available and remote care is available with Signia Assistant. What remote care does is it connects you with an audiologist in case of any issues and the audiologist can do the necessary settings which will be reflected into your hearing aids. All this can happen without visiting an audiologist. So it is a very helpful feature. Well, now we will be discussing the cons of Signia NCO Charging Go AX hearing aid. It has no Bluetooth for complete in the canal hearing aid, CIC hearing aid. It has no full shell in the ear hearing aid. It has no hands-free capabilities without an accessory. It, there is no tap feature for initiating the streaming. Disposable battery options are not available. 
OVP is not available. What OVP is? OVP OVP is phone voice processing. Usually, people have a tendency to reject hearing aids because their own voice sound robotic in their ears while wearing a hearing aid. So, OVP was introduced in many other devices in Signia, yeah? but OV, OVP functionality is not available in this particular set of models. The tinnitus features which we discussed before cannot be adjusted as per the tinnitus frequency. Telecoil options are not available in InsureX. So now we'll be talking about the pricing of all the three technology levels available for NCO Charge & Go AXO. The MRP of NCO 7AX is 3,46,990. The MRP of NCO 5AX is 2,20,990. And the MRP of NCO 3AX is 1,56,990. So if you are contacting us we could definitely provide a good discount on these hearing aids. So if you're planning to buy one of these hearing aids, you could contact us and we could definitely give you a good discount on these hearing aids. So how can you buy Signia Insure Charge & Go AX hearing aid? The best place to purchase is the best place to purchase a hearing aid is via an RCI certified audiologist. We at Hearing Vox provide you with an RCI certified audiologist who can evaluate your ear and help you understand your hearing better while providing solutions to make sure that your hearing capacity is at its best. You can contact us at 9372 double nine one three eight zero or visit us at hearingvox.com so this is it for today thank you for watching the whole video i hope this video provides a lot of value to you we'll be seeing you soon in the next video thank you